Hey everyone, I hope you're all well. A quick update about this Jet JT350. So yesterday, a very cool thing happened. I had uh, Philip come over here all day, which was fantastic. I had such a lovely time. Philip is often commenting under my videos and stuff, and it's been a year now we've been talking on Messenger and everything, so it was time to meet, since he lives uh, not far away from my place. You know. Very lovely guy with a great sense of humor, which was perfect. I had a blast, really. So we obviously talked about guitars, we did jam together and stuff. He tried every of my guitars, basically. But one guitar, that was very funny to see, one guitar sat on his knees pretty much all day long, and it was this one. Uh, he also loved the Spider Vintage Modified, and he liked this one a lot too, for a price anyway. So it was very interesting for me to have him here and try the guitars because, you know, different players, different opinions, basically. And uh, for example, the court one, he thought it was like a toy, basically. <laughs> he really didn't like it. But yeah, I offered him one day to come and shoot videos with him. That would be really nice, I think. So if you would like to see that, please comment below and <laughs> I'm sure he will read it, you know. Also, very interesting thing, he owned a GNL a set Blues Boy, basically. So this is the exact same type of guitars with the same pickup configuration. And he actually preferred this one uh, from playing it yesterday anyway. He, he really, really liked this guitar. I have to say, it feels amazing to play. It's so comfy. It stays in tune really well, and I didn't change the strings or did any setup yet. If I had to say something about this guitar, maybe just the bridge pickup sits a bit behind, but once I will put fresher strings and everything, hopefully it will come to life a bit more, you know, even though it's already really great. One thing really weird that happened yesterday through is that Philip played this one a lot, and he got his fingers black. So I've seen another review uh, of someone uh, reviewing the Jet Les Paul. I think it's called the JL500. Um, and he had the same issues playing the guitar at first with uh, <laughs> fingers turning black basically. So that's what happened to Philip yesterday. It's of course nothing crazy, but the weird thing is I've been playing it a lot the night before, the day before. And today, and <laughs> it's not happening to me, so it's really weird. It must be some kind of a Finnish issue. But yeah, what I can tell you about this guitar now, it's been two days uh, playing it and having Philip to come and play it too and giving his opinion about the guitar. It's such an amazing guitar to play. It feels so good and it feels really quality. That was Philip's opinion too yesterday. Uh, but it feels quality, the neck is gorgeous, it feels so good to play. The locking tuners are beautiful, actually, and the guitar is beautiful, really. He also loved the neck pickup uh, and basically the tones. So yeah, after two days now, uh, I didn't change my mind about it one bit. Uh, for 300 euros, it's, it's hard to beat, really. Anyway, if you have any question about this guitar, about something I didn't mention yet, of course, do not hesitate. I'll see you later. Have fun, stay safe, and be funky. Ciao, ciao, ciao.